Hey guys, Lisa here. So tonight's going to be a quick one. Um, I just want to talk about, you know, success and the people that you're with and who you look up to and who the people that you're around. Um, do you always choose to be the most successful person in the room? If so, you're not, there's no room for you to go any higher. Um, I've always learned to look for people that you admire, um, people that you look up to and try and um, emulate them. Not so much copy them because you don't want to be a copycat, but you want to be around people that are more successful than you, that have greater success, that have what you want and follow their lead. Um, if you're in a room full of people or if the people that you hang around with, you're the smartest person in the room or you're the most successful person in the room, where is that leaving you to strive to get to? Nowhere, right? Because you're already it, you know, you really have nowhere to reach out and reach up to. So, you know, I've always made it a habit to look for people that are, um, not so much smarter, but yeah, smarter, better, more successful, um, and have the things that I want, um, and learn from them. You know, it, it's a good thing to be the dumbest person in the room, I guess you can say, um, because it gives you room to grow and gives you something to strive for. Anyway, that's my tip for today.